Hello everyone. Today we have the newly launched compact class series product Testo 535 which is, which is a CO2 measurement device. Now the new Testo 535 is ideally suited for the simple fast and accurate measurement of the CO2 level to ensure the uh, indoor air quality. As you know that CO2 measurement is an integral part of the IAQ that is the indoor air quality measurement. It also comes with a brand new look and a more sturdy and uh, compact design. Now the front side of the instrument you can see that it is having a very large uh, clear LCD display where you can uh, see the uh, CO2 level at this very moment right now. And uh, the back side is having uh, the dis I mean uh, the details of the instrument, the model name as well as the serial number, and uh, the back side is having the uh, three numbers of 1.5 5 volt AA batteries. Now, uh, if you uh, see uh, the buttons here, so uh, it is also having the long press and short press op option. All these buttons. Now, uh, short pressing this button actually will give you the uh, uh, hold. That means it will uh, you know hold the value right now. What it is uh, having capturing. Then again, it will show what is the maximum uh, level of the CO2 it has been measured so far, and also the uh, minimum CO2 level. So, uh, long pressing this uh, left arrow key will enable or disable the uh, Bluetooth uh, option as well. Now, the right arrow key, if you long press it, then uh, if you are having a Testo a Bluetooth printer, so what it will do that long pressing this uh, key will directly uh, print the data. So, you can directly see at uh, the site where you are doing the measurement. The mode option, uh, you, you know, if you are uh, short pressing this mode option again, so you can have two options here. Uh, the two options are first is uh, you are having the uh, multi point measurement, okay, and the second option is the uh, timed uh, average. So, multi point means, uh, for example, if there is a closed room and you want to understand what is the CO2 level, then you select some of the points. Uh, three four points and you uh, check the co2 level and it will directly uh, calculate the average of the uh, co2 level and timed average means uh, for example if you have chosen 30 seconds so after 30 seconds uh, it will calculate the average of the uh, co2 level so both of these options are available so different utilities are uh, you know using different standards so that's why we have implemented these options now if you uh, choose uh, the menu option here so in menu you can generally configure the units uh, as well as uh, you know you can say uh, select the units as well and you can set the alarm that what should be the minimum and maximum level and uh, again uh, you know the uh, what is the ambient temperature you can see here and what is the absolute pressure right now uh, as well as the firmware version you can see here so uh, this uh, configuration uh, button is also available here and if you generally uh, long press it then the uh, illumination part the backlit lcd will uh, disable or enable uh, so this option is there so if you long press this mode button here uh, then again it will uh, uh, the instrument will uh, shut down now uh, okay so uh, Let's come to the app connectivity part. As you know that each and every uh, Testo Compact Class series is having the option of the uh, Testo Smart App connectivity. So uh, we will see how the uh, Smart App connectivity here right now. So I have uh, enabled the uh, Testo Smart App here. So let's see what's happening. So it is directly giving you the uh, you know live value here. What is the PPM? Here you can you know change uh, the unit so percentage or PPM whatever uh, unit you can you can you know select here as per your uh, usability so ambient pressure it, it is also showing the ambient pressure as well as the uh, temperature so right now if you start uh, the measurement and uh, you know if you uh, stop it you can also show the graphical display here in the app it is showing and uh, in the tabular format also it, it can be uh, shown what are the values are coming so again uh, if you stop the measurement so this uh, here you can see the date and time of the measurement as well as you can uh, add the customer details for which customer uh, premises you are taking the measurement 
uh, attached images means you can take the image on that particular site where you are uh, taking it and your, your remarks uh, is also you can mention it here and then if you generally create uh, the report then uh, in the pdf format the report will be created where you can see the details of the instrument uh, as well as uh, the readings in tabular format it has come so like this uh, you know the measurement report it can be uh, created here in the app itself and you can uh, share it with the i mean uh, either via email or whatsapp or any other uh, social media options directly you can also export it into the csv that is the excel file excel format as well as if you are having any uh, other you know file formats you want to share then that json format is also available so uh, like this you know uh, you can uh, check what is the co2 level uh, of uh, a meeting room as well as offices as well as in a particular production area uh, so these are some of the application areas you know uh, there are uh, applications like hotels also in hotels yeah iaq is a very important parameter in airports as well uh, we will generally check that what is the temperature humidity as well as the co2 level in that uh, you know on those particular applications uh, this uh, 535 test to 535 is uh, very useful it is also having one feature of the it is equipped with an ndir sensor so it is having a long life as well as you know uh, it is it will also give you uh, a very accurate result because of its uh, cross sensitivity uh, um, you know feature so uh, this is a very uh, you know uh, accurate and precise instrument where you can check and detect the level of uh, co2